What is going on guys and girls, it is Ghost Robo and welcome back to some more Stealth Inc. If you remember, this was the first game in Sony's 2013 PlayStation Network Play program and I love it. It strikes the perfect blend between challenging puzzler and never becoming too frustrating, particularly because they include such an element of finesse and movement. Like, you don't find yourself just sitting there staring at the screen, you're always moving, always doing something and uh, even if you die, it's not too big of a punishment so you can kind of get back back at it real quickly. Um, I've included a download link in the description below if you want to pick it up for yourself. $9.99, I think it's totally worth it. But we're here in the World 2 boss, and uh, this one's a lot about, oh god, a lot about moving these drones around, uh, as opposed to stationary pillars or things like that. This time I gotta move these guys that have a nasty little eye. Oh, no, 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 come back, go back down. And they really want to kill you at any any chance they can get. They don't, they don't love you, they don't hug you, they don't cuddle, they're they're kind of a portal sentry turret ask in that their main priority is to kill you at all costs and come over here and really creep me out. Um, what I'm going to do is trap this guy right on that button. Okay. And that creates a field of darkness over here. So I think that this creepy spinny eye boss that he has a field of vision as big as Australia won't see me while I'm hacking away. All right, we open that up. Guessing that's our next pathway up here to the right to the right oh okay oh god don't see me don't see me I have to follow the, the cone as it moves <gasps> all right that opens that so I clearly have to get over and avoid this camera at the top right you can see that guy it's kind of got like a crab mouth like a half-life head crab weird creepy mouth um how am I gonna do this let's see all right I got no god the eyeball boss is like so freaking omniscient it knows where I am if I'm ever visible it's like I found you it know oh my god! I have to time my jumps perfectly here. It's like a freaking mom. It knows where you are at all times. Okay. It's got that third eye, quite literally. Um, okay, so three, two, one. We on the move. We on the move. Okay, we're safe. Now, this is a little nerve-wracking because I have to push this guy and make sure it... No? How does it... Oh, they're not going to be pleased with me at R&D as I continue to bust open their robots. They're clone robots, though, so that does that cost any money, you think? If it's a clone bot? It's probably cheaper than, like, a, a full-on robot, I'd imagine. Okay, so that's not gonna work. The shadow is determined based on the positioning of that light cone, so somehow I have to find the right timing to push it down there without anybody spotting me. As you can see, it gets really challenging and tricky, but I never find it frustrating. I'm never like, oh dear, this is upsetting at all. I'm gonna be spotted. Okay. No! Oh, God, so close, baby. All right. How can I get this so that it doesn't see me? It's got to have something to do with the timing, right? Like, I'm, I'm here, but then it's, the cone goes away is it shifts to that side, so I need it to be there. Okay, I guess I just do a little bit at a time. Cause yeah, see, then there's no there's no protection at all. Okay, I'm making progress. A few more bumps, and we're gonna boosh this guy down into its hole. Okay, I'm out. Holy crazy guju! All right. Oh god. See, it's the all-seeing eye. It knows where I am at all times. Okay, so I'm gonna have to backtrack and close off that door. You see that door on the, like, right-hand side of your screen there? Basically the one that's preventing me from hacking at free will. All right, so follow the space cone here. And, um... I don't think it's gonna... No, you don't know who I am. You don't know who I am! All right, that's what I need to do. But first I gotta get up here. It's very procedural, which I like, like, okay, then you do this, then you do that, and I feel like it, it has a great sense of, like, a great sense of, um, progression, you know what I mean? Like, it, it all feels like it fits very well to me. Get out of here. Okay, now that he's down there, all right, now we just gotta boost him up, and I think that's gonna lock in the door, right? Yes, okay, now he's locked in there. And now I have to go through here, which it, he can't see me, I don't think, because this is all bathed in darkness. Um. Oh, God. No, 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 no. <laughs> 
I'm turning into a robot with the noises I'm making too. Which way is he gonna go? Spin around. Yeah, get the heck away from me. Nope, you don't know who I am. You don't know where I'm at. You don't know nothing about me. Alright, and now it's locked. So even though I'm fully visible, I can hack myself out of here. Boosh! I did it. I defeated the eye. And now we need to make it back down before he <laughs> wakes up and says, Who is invading my secret castle? I'm going... No! A freak of nature! Are you joking? Alright, at least I saved my checkpoint here. It's really great about checkpoints, which again keeps it from ever being upsetting. I'm excited to check out World 3 with you guys. I think that'll be cool. So we're gonna beat this boss real quick and then jump right into uh, the third world. Oh my god. Stealth man, hold on. Alright. Um, no, you don't see me. I don't... Well, maybe not. It's freaking teasing me with its trickery. Okay. Wow. Note to self, don't touch laser shooting cameras. Alright. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. And I'm out. Yeah, buddy. World 2 complete. Test complete. Um, I didn't do the best. I think I did pretty good. You can, if you have the game yourself, definitely try to beat my score on the leaderboard, which is 3 minutes, 18 seconds. People are crazy. 53 seconds. They must know what they're doing. And, like, go just completely complete ham with it. Alright, so sector two is complete. We're moving on to the third world here. Um, and if you go back and play the levels, the way that you can get those faster times, just to show you, is you unlock these different suits um, based on your, your you know, performance in that world, and then you can go back. Like this one allows you to charge up a little invisibility camouflage for a few seconds, and, and that would obviously greatly uh, assist you in kind of circumventing some of the natural progression of the levels and creating your own pathways. But Sensors are a new thing in this world. Sensors respond to touch, so... Oh, okay. Interesting. So I'm guessing I gotta get... That guy out of there. Holy cow, don't shoot! Alright, so now he is gonna be sort of the, uh... The initiator of these sensor touchers. Alright, so I gotta... How am I gonna do this? Oh, I guess I just gotta jump over his head. Ah, you stupid robot. If only you had seen parts on your skull, then you would find me, but that's not the case. Think ahead, okay. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Whoop! And we're out of here. Wear goggles at all times. No wonder our guy has so many awesome goggles. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, I think I'm in trouble. I'm gonna be smushed, Chewbacca style. Is thinking not your strong point? <sighs> the game, it knows, it knows, it knows, it knows. Does it have a nose? It has definitely a freaking thinking mind, but I don't know if it has a nose. Okay, I got it. Okay, there we go. Oh! How did... Oh my god, okay, so don't let it touch you until you're ready to fall. Your performance is graded. Okay, it's gonna shut it down. Do I get that little sneaky gel pack? How do I get that guy, you think? Oh! <laughs> if I duck, if I duck it, it shuts it off, so I don't think I can get that thing. Maybe I can turn off the beam here. We'll try it out. Ooh, I'm taking notes on you. All right, I need him to fall down. Get down. Yep. Yeah. Oh, 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 ah, ooh. All right, one more try. We've got it now. It makes me feel smart. It's one of those games. Um, Braid did that. Um, even Limbo, to a certain extent, when you would complete a puzzle, uh, they did a nice job of making you feel like you were some kind of mini genius. And I think that's definitely a success of Stealth Think is that it, it rewards you for, for being smart. Um, I gotta go around. Yeah. I don't know what that gel pack is. You think I should collect it? Looks like some secret ooze. I don't know if we're gonna spawn Ninja Turtles or turn into one, but I'm kind of interested to see what happens. Ooh, I got the freaking Magicka pack. Whatever that does for me, I'm excited to find out. It's probably just a score boost, honestly. We'll have to find out. I got a Helix located, yeah, so it's some sort of collectible. Um, let's do a couple more here for us. I think the bosses are my favorite because there's the most sense of danger. I used to do your job. Oh, did you? It reminds me so much of Portal in a lot of ways. I mean, obviously, 
very different in a lot of ways, but I was much better at it than you. Oh god. Must try harder. Alright, so we have to walk right No! <laughs> Lining yourself up with moving beam. Trickier than it may look. Wow. No, goodness gracious. Alright, I'm gonna jump as soon as I can. I'm gonna jump. Because I, I apparently am horrible at this. My timing is not. Okay, we got it. We got it. We got it. Got it. Yes. Practice makes perfect. You just had to focus in a little bit there. I'm sure you'll improve. Whoa, cool. All right. Hack it out of here. Shut down. Okay. So this should move the platform with me. Yeah, buddy. There's weird bones all over, and I don't, I don't... Like, they're killing people here. It's a little bit... Honestly, a little bit eerie. I'm not too sure what's going on in this wacky world. Okay, that should be good. Button time, that one. I need to move that guy over there. Okay. Again, they're really adding a lot of systems. It makes it pretty cool and fun. I gotta now line all these up. Oh wow, weird. It completely blocked it off. I was like, what the heck? How did that stop from there? Okay. Get out of the freaking path of the light. Alright, now this guy I just have to move. Not that one. I think I can probably make this, I bet. He luckily freaking leaps like Jordan, which is very lucky. Otherwise, a lot of this stuff would be impossible. Take your time. Alright, so I'm gonna definitely have to go up first, I think. Let's move this guy back here. Alright. Jumping is key. Now what is this gonna do? That opens that door and opens this door. I don't know, that activating that does nothing. Okay. I think we're good. This should just move us across, right? Bingo! And I'm up and I'm out of here. Skadoosh, I like it. I love it, I like it, I love it, I like it. B rank, okay. Again, like, because you can unlock all these extra suits, and I haven't even figured out how to get those third, fourth, fifth, and uh, sixth suits, but when you had those, I can see why people get such fast times. I'm like, how is someone doing this at such incredible speed? But I think a lot of it has to do with the fact that they are um, using those alternate suits and stuff. Okay, so that, what is that open again? That first door? No, that one. It closes that off. What does this do? Lowers that. Which does nothing. But I'm guessing if we trap him on the other side, drone control is probably my greatest specialty. I have a PhD in creepy laser bot uh, activation. That opens that. But now... Alright, so I have to get up here. And he's not looking. Turn away. Don't spot me. Nope. Huh, weird. Somehow I have to like drop a dude. Can he see me if I'm happy? He can't, wow. What a dumb little bot. Okay, so now the, that's activated, but I just have to get the drone back down so that I can um, move to the computer. Do you see where you are? Ah! This does nothing, it's a dead switch now. I do see where I went wrong, but Oh my god. Patience is a virtue in this game, really. Sometimes you just want to run through, but you're like, no, I have to be patient. Okay. So we're going to bring him back down. And I guess... What is this? That just does that. What opens the door over there? Not that. Come back down. This? No. Yes? No. I'm all confused. Oh, I think I know which one it is. Okay. That opens that door, so I have to be up there somehow. Alright. I gotcha. Oh, he's gonna just fall. Okay. Yes! No. 
<laughs> yeah, buddy. All right. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. We win the day. Oh, no. It's not winning the day because that's creepy crazy. All right. I think I got it. I think I got it. No? Yes, I can just jump across, right? And it's open. Beautiful. We'll hack our way to victory. Save the princess, or at least the clone. Feel pretty good about myself here. That is a few levels from World 3, the boss from World 2. Stealth Inc., definitely one of the cream of the crop of the entire year in terms of downloadable games and in terms of fun puzzlers that you don't really ever feel stuck slash stalemated, which I, I definitely really appreciate. So check it out for yourself. Link down in the description if you want to go pick it up on the PlayStation Network. Until next time, guys and girls, hope you enjoyed the video. Hit that like button if you did. Add your favorites if you really think this game looks awesome. And until next time, drink some hot chocolate. Thanks again, and we will see you all later.